name is Rowan and this is Six Foot Technical. Today I'm going to talk to you guys about my new um, Milsum bag carrier. Um, I, as you see in my previous videos, I usually wear a flick carrier, but for those longer games, I can only fix megs in the flick carrier and need more megs for like longer games. Now, when I say Milsum, I mean any airsoft event longer than like single game, like a full uh, through the night game, you know? Um, because the more megs, more megs, more bullets for um, more BBs. And we all know that more bullets is always better. Now, this specific one, yeah, I think it's a Marine Corps issue um, apps, technical assault panel. Um, I think, I meant, I'm not going to on that. But I got this from a uh, surplus to buy them for uh, 40 bucks at your most military surplus stores. Um, I got mine for like 40 bucks. They have multi K, I have a couple and a half houses, but I just got Kyle for this other thing. Um, and it's actually super light and comfortable. Um, one of the reasons that I bought it was because um, the straps, they don't have a lot of support, but like they're small, which allows you to backpack over them really easily. For, again, you know, again, I'm hopping out with me, but you can you imagine it. Um, now, it comes, it's, it's just basically comes with it, but you see right here. Um, it's kind of like a thing, it's similar to so like suspenders, um, and it also comes with a bunch of other straps, so like if you break any of this stuff here, um, you can fix it. Um, and you basically just unclick this and just take it on and off super easily. And fact, I think it's pretty cool. Um, there's, you guys can't really see here, but let's see. On the inside of it, there is um, zippers and pouches for maps um, and whatever you might need to put in there. And it's this nice uh, kind of mesh webbing that allows you to really uh, stay cool. Um, and then again, it just connects here on the other side. So you can take this whole um, uh, rig off and it just comes on not super easily. Um, and it holds a lot of a lot of mags, like a ton of mags. Um, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight mag pouches. And you can also have more on the front if you want to. There is um, molding webbing in the front so you can add more pouches if you need to. And I actually really like how the mags are in there because they're not like too loose and hard to get to, or they're not too like tight until they, they, they won't fall out, but they're also not hard to get to like a lot of other ones. Um, or they're not super easy to get, but they fall out. They're a nice mix. So basically you can just pull this strap right here. See that? You just pull that out and then boom, you got your mag. Um, and it comes in really nice and fast when you're trying to get in a high stress um, air stock in. Um, but I think it looks great. Um, I like how I like how it fits. Uh, it's a little bit bouncy when you're running around, but it's not a huge deal. Um, again, I got Coyote, there's all the colors, but I just like how Coyote goes with my multi-cam um, and, and just most of my multi-cam. And I also like how you can wear it with a bunch of different options, different, different camouflage, and it still looks great with all of them. Um, but super nice, super comfortable, and even now it's like 85 degrees here. It's not that bad out. It's not that bad wearing this thing. It's actually cool. Unlike the flight carry, which has like half an inch of like foam padding or whatever, and that's gonna overheat you real fast. Um, I will say that obviously you can't. There's not like protection against airsoft BBs. So if you get shot, like, oh no, oh, I got shot. You can actually feel it. Um, but it also, I know some, some eggs, um, they can get shot and actually broken. Because you have them sitting in there like this, it'll be like, on other ones, uh, the mags will be up a little bit. Like this, they can get shot. It's not, m most mags won't do this, but some can break. Um, which obviously is not good. Um, but it, this, this, this uh, system keeps it nice and, um, secure and also safe from keepers. Um Now I keep, let's see here, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I keep seven or eight eggs on me at all times when I'm wearing this. 
and I took a radio in this last pouch right here. Um, I don't have it out here with me, but in case it's just communication in, in um, Muslim is very, very important. So I thought it was nice to have. Um, you don't feel like a um, smoke grenade or whatever, whatever you need. Um, but it's real nice, comfortable, Velcro fast. Um, and like I said, here, you literally just take, take it on after you just unbuckle this on both sides. Um, it's just like a simple clip belt or clip buckle, and boom, off it goes. Um, but as you see, it probably a little better here. It's got this. We have, the, we have a carry handle here, so you can carry it inside for whatever reason if you need to do that. Um, and this is what was facing you like this, how it's going to be set. Um, but you can unzip this uh, and you put whatever um, things you need in there. I don't put a lot of, things, a lot of stuff in there because it's just kind of uncomfortable, I guess. But paper things would be perfect near like a map. Whatever, like as, as I was saying before, um, and it has these two pouches. You can put bigger items in here. You can see that very well. But um, yeah, just these neat little uh, like grab straps here. You can just hit up real fast, and then get that whatever items you have inside. Um, now the actual attachment system to like uh, where um, the carrying. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. What I'm doing. Um, but this right here. Uh, basically, as you can see, you just put it over your head, um, like that, and then these two on the back, uh, find it. it's a little bit of a pain to find the right one. It's not that bad though. You just, just clip them, you tighten them up. There's got a lot of adjustment in there. All right, there and there, so you, you can change it. You can change the height, the size. Um, so no matter how tall or wide you are gonna fit you. I'm a little bit, this is maybe a little bit bigger than I am, but it, 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 it cinches up a little bit on the sides, but oh well, it doesn't really bother me at all. Um, but I think it's a really nice um, system, and it's great for long airsoft games. I wouldn't say it's the best for like CQB um, or like super fast paced airsoft games because, well, like, just like your local day game, um, it will work, but it won't be as good as like a plate carrier or a battle belt or something like that. Those will work. Um, they're, they're faster, obviously. But this is great for like for laying down and doing a lot of like stuff, like mills and stuff, I guess. Um, I don't know. But again, you were backpacked over it really, really comfortably. Like when you went, I was wearing a uh, uh, three day assault pack with this thing for like three hours straight not an issue at all this it was completely fine um <clears throat> what else and again it's it's it's, it's this super uh similar material to what my uh jacket actually made out of but super strong dense like nylon or whatever i don't know what it is but it's super it's, it's super strong it will not break under all the stress um super nice um yeah, I really like it, and I use it in comparison in, in conjunction with my got a proper boonie cap here. Um, again, this is just surplus. Buys at most surpluses. I got mine at um, where was it? Uh, Army Navy Outdoors. Great website. I really like their stuff. Um, I also got these pants. Um, these are just like cheap Chinese knockoffs because I can't afford actual crop precision pants. Uh, they're just like idle gear ones off Amazon. And they have some nice pockets on them and stuff. You really in there put mags in there uh but whatever um this is also a uh i think i got this one from a different surplus store i don't, can't remember which one but it's it's just like a uh flame retardant um ocp jacket catch face super nice super comfortable um obviously yeah it's a little hot out but what you gonna do um i think i got, I got my boots here these are the proper international eight inch or a proper series 108 inch boots. Um, super nice. They got this like pseudo, uh, pseudo, pseudo cow leather, whatever it is. They're awesome boots. Um, I would recommend getting some if you want. They have like a fake or like a synthetic composite toe, um, which is super, super nice to have. Um, they're a little hot, but like whatever. It's not a big deal. Um, but yeah, it's, sorry it's been a while. I got 
some a video removed because I didn't check my uh, didn't go over it very well, so it's my fault. Um, yeah, I'm gonna have a couple couple of videos uh, out soon, and I'm gonna try and be a little more careful with them. Um, so I will see you guys in a little bit. I'm going to make another video today, actually, about this my brand new airsoft gun, and I will explain a lot more about this in a future video. So I will see you guys later. My name is Rowan. And this is Secret Tactical. I hope you have a great day.